Hello everyone and welcome to the FCFD. I'm David Johnson and today we're going to be talking a little bit more about composite modes, specifically using the alpha channels. Now, we know composite modes can combine tracks above and below in different fashions. We also know that the term alpha deals with transparency. So today let's make a newer lower third graphic by using this channel. Now this is the graphic we're going to make and we can see that through the text there's some neat motion occurring. So how did we do this? Well first we want to open a new sequence and drag our main footage down to track 1. Next we want to make our black lower third bar and we can do that by generating a solid color in our viewer. Let's do that and then change its color to black by heading over to the controls tab and modifying it. After the color is correct head back to the video tab and drag this solid down to track 2 in the timeline. However, because it's still full screen, we need to crop it a little bit. So let's make it into our actual lower third by taking the crop tool and with image in a wireframe turned on, drag down the top and the bottom up until it's just at that lower third of the screen and looks how you want it to. And I'm also going to be turning down my opacity a little bit by clicking the mountains icon in the lower left hand side of the timeline. And then taking the arrow tool and dragging down the black bar for opacity. Now when it's how we want it to be, we can get the text. Now let's generate the text for the track above by heading over to the viewer and doing that now. Let's boogie on up to the controls tab and change this sample text to what we want. In my case, I'm going to put Final Cut, Final Tip. I will also change the font because I'm not a fan of the standard text. So let's go back to the video tab now and drag this newly created text down to track 3. Reposition it using image and wireframe and we're getting much closer. So lastly, let's place on track 4 the motion, what we want to show through the text track. Now for my sanity, I'm going to make all these tracks the same size and when that's complete, I'm going to right click the video track on track 4, go to composite mode, and then select travel matte alpha. This is going to make the top track transparent except through the white text below. And there we have it, a great new way to make some professional looking lower thirds. Thanks for joining me on this FCFT, and I'll see you on the next one.